Celebrities are releasing products from makeup to food to fashion and even toys. So today I'll be testing each product to see if they live up to the hype or if they're a fail. I have a five star system to see which celebrity products are worth buying. Let's spin the mystery wheel to see which product we are testing first. First up, Logan Paul and KSI Prime Drink. As you all know, I love Prime. Mm. So we will be doing the mystery box Prime taste test challenge to see if I really know my flavors. First up, fruit punch. Yes. Oh, that one tastes a little odd. Uh, lipstick, orange, darn. Next, lemon. Yes. Next up, tastes like lime. Yes. Final flavor, whoa, Skittles, darn. Time to rate their products. Pretty good, but could do better, which is giving them a four. Let's test out the next product. Ooh, Arak Pizza Fly Sauce. This sauce is supposed to make everything taste like pizza. We have a variety of items from candy to bread and meat to chips and crackers. Shares, comment down below if you think this is actually going to work. So let's test it out. Let's take the chip, dip it. It actually does. Next, a cracker. That tastes like a pizza cracker. Let's head down the line and let's make a pizza sandwich. Perfect. Put the bread together and let's see. Mmm. This actually is better than those two. It literally feels like I'm eating a real pizza from Domino's. The real test. Will this candy and chocolate taste like pizza by putting the sauce on? Take this lollipop and Let's eat it up. Whoa, that's absolutely disgusting. Mm. But it did change the lollipop to taste like pizza, so it did work. After that, I'm a little scared to taste chocolate with this pizza-fied sauce. Oh, this, I can already tell it's gonna be a bad combo. Embrace myself and, mm. yeah, it tastes like pizza, but um, that is a, not a good mix. Time to rate Arak's product. His product is very rare and creative. I'll give him points for that. But putting it on candy and chocolate, oh, never doing that again. Surprisingly, I'm gonna give him a four. Let's clean this up and on to the next product. Taylor Swift. Taylor Swift is making headlines with her Eras tour that means Steven actually went to her boyfriend. And if you're a true Swifty, you will know that Taylor Swift is all about her friendship bracelets. Not only do I have this rainbow one here, but I made the viral TikTok jumbo Taylor Swift friendship bracelet. This is pretty epic, so comment down below if you like Taylor Swift and let's give her a rating. I think she deserves a five star rating. Bringing out the James Charles makeup line. James Charles recently released a new makeup line called Painted. Everyone knows James Charles is a fantastic makeup artist. So I'm not gonna try and use it for makeup. I'm gonna see if it lives up to the paint experience. Comparing his painted line with normal, regular paint. Let's unbox these colors. And I mean, that is super cute. Let's open it up, put some on the plate. So on one side of the canvas, I'll be using regular paint with normal paint brushes. And on this side of the canvas, I'll be using all of James Charles's products. Let's give this a try. At any time, if you know what I'm painting, comment down below. This is the normal paint drawing. Now it's time to try James Charles painted product. What? Okay, that is phenomenal. This honestly might be better paint than the real paint product. Wow, this is so smooth. This paintbrush is amazing. Let's try the yellow. Look how much better this side is compared to the normal paint product. I truly did not think James's products would work on a canvas, but whoa, Painted Line blew this out of the park. Time to rate James Charles, and without a doubt, going all the way to the top for a five star rating. And just like that, we have Chamberlain Coffee. We'll be testing each of her flavors from the Night Owl blend 
all the way to social dog blend. Starting with the most basic, original family blend. I feel like this will just taste like normal coffee. Yeah, that tastes great. It tastes like, actually it kinda tastes like Starbucks coffee. Next is the night owl blend. But pretty basic. Next is the careless cat blend. This is where we start getting into the interesting flavors. That's good. It doesn't taste like cats, and I cannot tell you what it tastes like. Next, the early bird blend. Mmm, that's pretty good. Next up, the social dog blend. Hopefully it doesn't taste like dogs. Very interesting taste. Kind of tastes like blueberry lavender. It's actually pretty good. Time to give Emma Chamberlain a rating. But they all tasted like the same flavors, so I'm gonna have to put her smack dab in the middle. Not the best, but not the worst. Mmm! Oh my goodness, super sour! The next product is Phase Rugs 1 Up Super Sour Challenge, which is very similar to the One Chip Challenge. It has the same similar boxing. Let's open this up and let's fully test out his sour gummy. This is really interesting. There's like so many rules of how to do it. There's a neutralizer. I might be needing this because me and Steven recently did the spicy versus sour. I was spicy. Oh! End of this challenge. No, things about to get real spicy. Grace's first punishment, the world's hottest peanut. <laughs> so now it's time for me to try sour. Let's get this neutralizer on standby. That way, if it gets too sour, I can save myself. Oh, it's so sticky. There it is, the super, super sour. It doesn't smell sour. I mean, if there's literally one in the box, that makes it super intense, just like the one chip challenge. Mm. Oh my goodness. Okay, that is actually so sour. I didn't even eat the whole thing yet. And it's so sticky, it's sticking to my teeth. Ooh, oh my goodness. Okay, let's hope this neutralizer works. Woo! Oh. Wow. Oh my goodness. This doesn't taste good, but it kind of helps. Oh, this is so sour. Oh my goodness. I think we need to cut the camera. Woo! Yeah, I'm sweating so much. Oh my goodness. Since I don't like sour, I'm gonna have to give him a one. The next product we have is Selfie Vlog LED Ring Light Set. This is the ring light here. It's really cute. It's like a heart and it has the iPhone holder. Ooh, okay, this is nice. It's a cute design and it has like a controller. It has a mode setting, ooh, yellow, neutral, and white light. Okay, that's nice. I use a lot of ring lights. For instance, I'm actually using one right now to film this video. I can testify that this one is actually pretty good. Super portable for Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube shorts, holds the iPhone. So, time to give them a rating and giving them a five. Woo! Oh yeah, next product is the Team RAR Money Gun. For the shares who don't know, this is one of my brother Carter Share's merch products. Today, I filled this money gun up with subscriber shouts. So shares, if you have already, make sure you're commenting in my comments below. I'm looking through my comments in each video and doing a subscriber shout out. Let's see who gets a shout out in today's vlog. Woo! And today's shout out goes to Mark Smith 159 Thank you so much, Mark, for being an epic sharer. Next shout out goes to Carly Meacham. The third shout out goes to Jackson Clark. Last two shout outs go to JE061 and Tristan Thomas. Woo! Thank you so much for being an epic sharer. Shh, listen up. Time for a prank. I'm going to rate Carter's product. A, one, but I'm gonna trick it. I don't actually think it's a one. I think it's pretty cool. I think it's a five star rating. So if you want a money gun, go check out tmar.com. Let's keep this our little secret. Woo! This next product is from Do Perfect. They do a lot of trick shots. So let's see if I can do one today. Here we go. Oh my goodness, I got it. Whoa, that was impressive. I mean, I'm impressed with myself. Maybe I should join the basketball team. Let's rate this product. A five star rating. Next up is the JoJo bows. Everyone knows JoJo Siwa for her bows, which are pretty simple and every little girl's staple. 
So we're gonna twist it up a notch and test out Jojo Siwa's bow craft kit. The challenge is try making one of her craft bows look like one of her real bows. Put that there. Adding all the colors to the rainbow, just like the real bow. Adding the same detail in the middle and bam. Right down below, does my painted Jojo bow match the real Jojo bow? Give me one through 10 rating. I'm scrolling through the comments right now, seeing everybody's ratings. I see Cha Cha 1690 giving me a rating of six. Johnny Polkland 3243 an eight. Ooh, and there's a lot of tens. Time to give Jojo Siwa a rating of four. Uh, why can't I see anything? That's right, this is a blindfold mystery cookie challenge with Mr. Beast Feastable Cookies, if I can find them. Uh. Oh, this feels like the packaging. Now it's time to test out all these cookies that are somewhere in front of me. Right here. Cookies are laid out. Let's do a taste test challenge. Here's a bowl and let's try this one. Oh, this one's so easy. I can tell by just feeling this. This is Oreos. Oops. Yes, I got it correct. Next up, okay, and found the bowl. Nice. Ooh, these are squishy. Mmm. Oh, kind of smell like stinky feet. Um, birthday cake? Oh man, I was so close. Next cookie. I think this is one. Oh, got some. Oh, got some in the bowl. Perfect. Oh, yikes. Smells like peanut butter? Mmm, peanut butter, yum. These are for sure Mr. Beast cookies, right? Yes, got it right. Now, here's one. Mmm, uh, these are, mm, they feel like original cookie. Chocolate chip cookie? Yes. Uh, where is the next bowl? Oh, here's one. Okay, perfect. Let's try these. They smell like nothing. Hmm. Mr. Beast chocolate chip cookies? Yay! With a three. They're good, but they just taste like any other cookie. Okay, I gotta clean this up. Next up, we got the Ariana Grande perfume, which is called the Cloud. Ooh, it even comes with a, whoop! What are you doing? Oh, hey you, what does that smell? Is that fart spray? Okay, well I guess it's a real test to see if her perfume can cover up stinky smell. Take down the fart spray, yuck. Okay, well, let me test it on here. Ooh, that smells good. And it comes with a cute little cloud container. A three. Next up is my brother, Steven Cher. Hey Steven, time to rate your merch. First up, Steven has his backpack. Wait. What does Steven have in his backpack? Uh, what? Why does he have this? <laughs> Weird. And, ooh, the Sharagini notebook. Time to play another prank, and I'm gonna pretend I give Steven a one. Boom. But really, of course, I can't give our merch a one. I'm wearing it right now. Love this merch. So that's right, Shares. If you wanna shop our merch, shop StevenShare.com. Next up, we got Jaden Smith's Just water. Very cool packaging. I love blue. Very clean. 100% spring water, but it's in like a squishy container. Interesting. We also got Vanessa Hudgens Cali water, which is super interesting. It's cactus water. So like water made out of cactuses. This is going to be interesting to try. We're going to do a blind taste test challenge to see if any of these waters taste different. First up, Mmm, tastes like water. Okay, uh, next one. Uh, tastes like water too. Next up, tastes like water as well. Next up, we got, tastes like water. They all taste the same. I can't tell them apart. So, Jane Smith and Vanessa Hudgens, your waters are getting a two star rating. There's two of them, two stars there. I don't know, they all just taste like water. Next up is Mr. Beast Gel Nerf Blaster. Comes with Orbeez. Let's test this out. Oh, oh, oh man, this is intense. Oh, okay, this is fun. This gets five stars. Shares, I'll see you next vlog. Comment down below which product was your favorite.